Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, DL for really, man. And you see what it is, man. We went to the 1v1 rush event, hardest event, first ever 1v1 rush event, man. And I had a ball, bro. You see what it is, man. We we made quick work of this shit, a little over 30 minutes, man. I, honestly, I, I didn't even know if I was going to fucking be able to do it. That's why you can't even see at the beginning this shit. I got right to it. You feel me? Because I had to go to work, my nigga. And I didn't know if I was going to win, so I didn't just record it right away. But then when I seen I had a point guard, say less. You feel me? Point guard for my first game? That's easy money. You know? You know, we got right to work on this nigga. He, point guard is not guard. He be slashing playmaker. Meta build. Best build on the whole game, my nigga. Like, ball handling on 99. Like, come on. My three is like an 82, midi like an 86, like I'm unguardable. Just playing with niggas, getting to work. Oh, ankle breakers, feel me? Just getting to work on niggas, trying to run it up real quick. Just honestly trying to get through this first game so I can see what's going on in the next game. Look, he backflipping and shit. He just know he ain't fucking with me. He didn't gave up. <laughs> you feel me? Easy money on this nigga, 16 to zero, as you see, bro. We just playing around with him out net by now. Because once a nigga get takeover, it's like, what else do I need to do, my nigga? Quick hezzy straight to the rack, man. He ain't guarding me. He's done for a backflipping and shit like a circus. Fucking clown. Feel me? He started reaching like a mug, trying to get the AI up in there, thinking that's going to get the job done. Like, come on, my nigga. That happened to me the other day when I was playing the 1v1 course, bro. Beat this two-way, three-level score like three times, bro. Then this nigga comes back around and quits immediately as I get the ball. So then I had to play against the AI, bro. AI had mad defense, man. Like, come on. That shit was so weak. But you see, man, big 99.6. We on our way, man. Two times rep. SS2 on the way, baby. And that's only 15 minutes. 15 minutes already in, man. And we already streaking. First game. I was running out of time, man. And honestly, this game right here, honestly, it took a long time. That's why I didn't show the whole thing. Because he was a two-way uh, rebounding wing, as you see. He actually has the only a SS or All-Star 2, but... I threw up some bullshit. He ended up getting the ball and um started getting a whole bunch of fucking just post uh post spin fucking bogus bullshit. But you see, we d up clamps come through intimidator pull up green like don't play down, boy. It's, I'm different out here. You feel me? Hezzy, behind the back. Oh, look at him. We got him dancing down there. Broke his ain't. Come on, man. Come on, man. What are you doing out here? Rebounding wing? Is is this your king right here? Got him. Got him dancing out here. Disco. You feel me? After that one, man, I was I had to try to get another ankle breaker. So I'm just snatch back and snatch back and all over the place trying to get this ankle breaker. But I'm like, I ain't wasting my time. Let me get this bucket real quick. You feel me? Quick step through, lay me on. That James Harden layup package is everything. There you go. You feel me? Hey. Uh, uh, green. I'm different. You feel me? Got him up out of here. He ain't touched the ball again. He was next, bruh. Next victim. SS2 try to pull up, man. I love it. Torch them. Torture. Man, it's the torture chambers out here, bruh. Don't, don't. Don't bring these little dudes and think they gonna guard me, bro. You, you should have put your weight up at 200 pounds, 190 pounds at least. <laughs> Body that man, at least. I don't care what badges you got on. Rim protector, post move, clamps, none of that gonna help you if you too small. You too small, B. Look. <laughs> Damn near stepped on him and put my nuts on his head, everything. You playing down, I'm a green up. It's like, what what are you doing? Play some defense. You got a whole backpack on. Come on, bro. Play some defense, my nigga. You think I ain't going to green up? You think that it's not green? What are you doing? 11 straight points on him. You see the hot start? I'm running a hot start for the rest of the year, bro. For a slashing playmaker or like a build that can't really shoot. Like, my build can shoot. 
I can shoot like a motherfucker. But like even for another slashing playmaker that has like just dunking and playmaking or something or uh any type of build that can't really shoot that good. Put that hot start on, bro. Your dude start acting different. Cuz your first 3 shots first yeah, I think it's like your first 2 or first 3 shots that uh hot starts kick in. And then you get a plus boost for every shot right there. So that's basically plus three on all your shooting, all your ball handling, all your dunking and everything just off of three shots. So I think if you in a wreck, you in a pro M or something. Ankles, like, come on, like, that's easy. Easy buckets. Oh, you see, he blocked my shit. Finally played some defense after I didn't put 15 on his head. And we like, all right, let's get it right. Let's see what, it, let's see what these handles about. SS2, you see, we, we clamping up four seconds and he didn't get me baseline i don't know why i didn't play baseline like i'm just thinking if he was smart he would have went middle but you know he did the dumb thing went baseline and my dumb ass got fooled and even right here i think he goes baseline again or no he shoots a dumb ass shot gets the ball and then yeah he goes baseline again and gets me but i mean like that's just that's weak to me everybody goes baseline that's the reason it's so easy on a 1v1 for me because everybody thinking you're gonna go baseline and i just go middle like it's hard to it's hard to guard because i can pull up at any moment and get my shot creating takeover you see he air balls board up you seen the defense baby like i was saying man i can just shoot middies and all that type of shit and get my takeover and just take you to the rack whenever i want to you feel me green up like you gotta play out here, my nigga. I could do this all day. I just rather go to the rack and force you to actually play some defense. <laughs> you feel me? Get him up out of here. Jumping and shit. Come on. You gotta do better than that. You had the ball, my nigga. You gotta do better than that. Got him up out of here real quick. Like I said, man. I, I should I should say I was lucky enough to even get those those guards, man. This time. Cause on the 1v1 course the other day oh my god big man after big man after big man now right here i was confused i'm like how the hell is he getting ball when i'm running the fuck up but he sell the bag immediately <laughs> you feel me and i just get right to work he think i'm not gonna bust his ass so i uh snatch him make him play up bust his ass like come on i could have just dunked on him look at his little ass i could have just banged out on him he an offensive threat my nigga like no no defense in his build you got all scoring you're not guarding me and plus you playing down <laughs> green up then green up shouty man that's what they call me you feel me i got hot zones all over the court and then i got the hot start it's like i'm deadly bro bang on that man's head get back out here man come on didn't i just bust your ass like disrespect 10 already on his head and we already on our way to four you feel me 2k not on my side though they didn't want me to win they made me boing and i'm like come on man good shot selection who you telling god damn it he do the uh you know he gave me right there nice move Behind the back, wrap straight to the lane, baseline. I'm like, okay, okay. Let me see. I knew he was going to do the behind the back wrap again. I go for the steal, and 2K ain't on my side, like I say. That's an easy steal, but hey, he can have it. He get gone. I feel like that was the fucking slowest dunk ever. I should have threw that shit. He should have missed it at least, but I'm like, yo, it's whatever. We're going to D up. I know this defense is going to come through. Look, he hit him bullshit. Good shot contest. Come on, that's he has to have Hall of Fame uh, quick draw or dead eye and dead eye. So I'm like, I was not even tripping. I'm like, yo, we are gonna get right. This man not gonna keep throwing up bullshit. You feel, you feel me? We gonna get right. D that man up, put him in the box. Look, give me baseline just like last time. So now I'm like, bro, I gotta D this man up. I'm running out of time. I'm looking at my phone and shit like, bro, I gotta go to work. <laughs> I'm like, man, if I lose this shit, I'm going to be so pissed off because then that's going to be the whole thing. I ain't going to be able to play again because I literally have to leave right after this. And what do you know? He forced some bullshit and I finally get my ball back. Uh, we get straight to work. Momentum, cross, oh, step back. Where you going? Bang on that man. You feel me? 
Now that should have got me my takeover. And my like, come on, I, I'm just like, oh my gosh. So I try to uh, uh, pull up a midi and get my takeover and miss that shit. Boing, bad shot selection. Then they still don't give me the steal. Like, oh my gosh, they were trying to sell me this whole game right here. That's how I feel. Cause they knew I had to go to work 2k be on that shit bro I know y'all niggas know 2k be fucking the nigga All the time look got my Me getting my ankles broken shit I ain't got my ankles broke the whole damn time I've been playing But he forced some shit Cause he know he not getting in my paint That was the only way he was gonna score He should have did that to start the game off He got a sharp shooting takeover I'm forcing him to shoot the ball but, Hey You feel me After that he didn't touch the ball again He didn't touch ball again you feel me? I had to get this man out of here so I can get out of here. You feel me? He don't know what to do now. On that man's head. You feel me? Couple of them things on him. Straight to the lane on him. DL for really, man. You know, I'm trying to close this man out. I'm like, I am not about to keep playing around with you. Get him out of here. Quick, hezzy, step back, going on him. You know, easy shit. Y'all can, I leave that behind the back rap shit to y'all. <laughs> like, it's not like I can't do it. I leave it to y'all, though. I'm trying to get niggas a body, especially on the 1v1 rush. First ever 1v1 rush event. Ever. Like, it's never, ever, ever happened before. And I fucking finished it. In 20 something minutes or 30 something minutes. First time, hopped in, immediately finished that shit. Whooped on niggas. Y'all see it, man? It's your boy, DL for really, aka Mr. Don't Reach. Got niggas up out of here, man, because I had to get up out of here. I was lucky enough. Thank God. <laughs> I'm like, oh my God, if I get a big man, this is going to be a 20 minute video. <laughs> nah, I'm joking. But yeah, man, that's all I got for you guys, bro. Just wanted to show you guys that I fucking made it, man. I did it. I fucking fucked niggas up in the 1v1 rush event. First ever 1v1 rush event with a slash and playmaker. Point guard. And I be doing this all the time. I take my build to the 1v1 and the ante up and just do the same thing, man. But, uh, man, I hope you guys like the video. Comment, subscribe, and fly with the fly, you dig. You see me, big drippy. Yee.